bad comments. People say, oh, you should park the truck till it gets better. And I just don't see how that can be an option. All right, good morning. We're in early Iowa. Look at the sunrise over there. Oh, I have been trying to film and edit and nothing's cooperating. So we're gonna try again today. Oh, we got uh, a couple reels of cable left. Parked next to this big monster crane last night. Uh, it has been hot over here in Iowa. I got one little project I want to do before it gets too hot. See this cable right here? This is the cable to keep the hood from all the way open. And if you look over on that side, you'll see the one over there. The little clip, it goes right there, if you see it. See the little right there? And uh, I bought some little clips. So, I got to uh, figure out which size it is. And we're going to fix that real quick. I got the clip on. I took the, uh, while I'm in here, I took the bug screen off. It's, it's on the inside here. I'm gonna clean out some of these bugs since I'm in here and partly dirty. All right, I think we're done messing around. I got the bug screen back in. Just these little clips right here pops in and out. Got the cable back on. Clip on. Clean up my mess. And then we'll get going. Alright. I think we're ready. We can get out of here. Storm Lake, Iowa, which should be about 15, 20 miles straight down this road here. Let's 
see if we can figure out how to get in and out of this scale. I'm assuming that's it over there on the left. Let's see what we're supposed to do.
this. <laughs> This is Sparky's. Um, if you remember, this little truck stop was the one that burnt down. And what was it? Sometime last year, I think it was. Uh, trucking with Schmidt, Kurt. I met him in this truck stop. We were parked way, way down there. But uh, they've uh, rebuilt. They rebuilt the place. So I went inside. So from right here, we got about 300 and something miles over to, we're gonna go to the Loves in Elkhorn, Wisconsin. 330 miles. And we're on Highway 20. This Highway 20 is the same Highway 20 that runs all the way over. I'm pretty sure it's the same Highway 20. But, uh, I think it's Highway 20. Nah, I take that back. I was wrong. I thought it was Highway 20 that went over Wisconsin. So this goes over to, um, uh, Dubuque. Dubuque, Iowa. So we'll get on I-20, take it over to Dubuque, and then we'll get a Highway 11 and run that over. And then we'll eventually end up at the Loves. So anyway, I'm in a little better mood. I have a load. I know what I'm doing. Even if it's something I don't want to do. And, uh... The load of boats are going to two dealers I've already been to before. Both of them are hard to get in and out of. But like you said, things are things are bad, man. It just it's just you gotta do whatever. So, I've had comments, people say, oh, you should park the truck till it gets better. And I just don't see how that can be an option. It's not going to get better in 
60 days, 90 days. I don't even think it'll be better by next summer. And to say go home and just park the truck and do what? I mean, I still got truck payment. I still got trailer payment. I still have a house payment. And to, get, and to say to go home and just sit at home for months and wait till it gets better, I, that, that's just not an option. So the options we have is to figure out how to make money with what we got. And it can be done. It's hard, but it can be done. So like I said, we got about eh, five and a half hours or so. We do have the axle up on our Dorsey trailer. And I've been driving a little bit slower. Save on fuel. I don't know if I said it or not, but we'll wait to get fuel over in Wisconsin. It's a little bit cheaper. Bye. See you when we get there. Alright, it's the end of the day. We're, uh, over here in Elk, I think Elk Grove, Wisconsin, at the Loves. I was going to get an oil change at the shop there, but they said it wouldn't be till tomorrow morning. So they're pretty busy, it looks like. I'm being sarcastic. Um, but we drove 393 miles today. We got about another 30 miles in the morning to go pick up our boats. And then we're going to take them down to uh, Myrtle Beach and Wilmington, North Carolina. And then we're going to pick up a load out of Wilmington. We're going to do that on Friday. And we're going to pick up a load near Wilmington going to Florida way down into Florida. We're going to Apalaca, Apalaca, Florida. I uh, I haven't been that far down in Florida in a long time. But uh, just got to do what you got to do. I was panicking a little bit. I didn't know what I was going to do for a load kind of worked out but got to go get it the uh, the load going down to Florida it's a decent load so we'll go way down into Florida with the intentions of bouncing out of there so that's what we're gonna do this guy here you guys can watch this guy hook up to his truck here he come out of the shop there I think he was getting a tire replaced what it looked like. He's hooking up. Clunk. There we go. So anyway, we'll call it quits for today. We'll hit it again tomorrow. Talk to you later.